I'm just trying, I'm just going to open the ears up. Are you? Yeah. Okay. Hi, Bamboo. Hey, good morning, guys. Where's Bamboo? Bamboo! It is somebody's big day today. That's right, Bamboo. It is your first birthday. <laughs> Congratulations. Okay, let's go outside. So it was just one year ago that Bamboo came to our lives as a little egg. The funny thing was, is that I of course asked my wife, Becky, for permission to get the emu egg. We bought two of them. I always had to come up with some type of story as to what my plan was with them. She was really hesitant when we got the peacock eggs is what we were gonna do with them. These emu eggs came up and I just said, we'll, we'll just hatch them out. We'll give them away to a farm or something. And of course it all worked out, but we didn't know it was gonna work out. But seeing bamboo hatch was just incredible. But after 50 some days of waiting on this egg to hatch, we were so excited to see bamboo for the first time. Guys, we wanted to introduce you to our newest animal on the farm, the emu. Hey guys, check this out. It's so cool. Yeah. It's so tall. Yesterday it's been my birthday, the hatch. It hatched on Eli's birthday. How about that? I didn't know we could hatch on my birthday. Pigs. Some big seed, huh? Yeah. And this guy has always been pecking stuff since he was just a little baby emu. Right, baby? <laughs> You're always pecking stuff. If I leave my ear exposed, it's getting pulled. Go run. making for bamboo we're gonna make a birthday cake I'm gonna chop his food up and then add some flour maybe some eggs some honey just to kind of make it into a cake and then we're gonna decorate it for him all right Just alfalfa? Pretty much. It's gonna be a little crumbly, I'm sure. That's fair. All right, let's check it and see if it'll come out of the pan. These little pans are fun because they have a little um, thing that goes on the bottom and gets them unstuck. So hopefully it comes out. All right, and I made some icing up. It's just yogurt, cornstarch, little milk, stuff that won't hurt them, so no sugar. Eli, you gonna have a piece of this cake? It looks so yummy though. No, not eating it. Alright, the final detail. 
looks amazing. Bamboo's gonna love it. What do you think, guys? You think Bamboo's gonna like it? Yes. Yes. Are you excited for his birthday party? Yes. Ready? Set. <laughs> All right, we're ready to have a big birthday party for the big guy. This cake actually smells really good, but I think that's mostly the icing. I don't think it's gonna taste that great. You ready for a birthday party? Yeah! Okay, so Bamboo has always had an obsession with socks. Look at it. Oh, you pulled one off already. So I sewed some socks to this rope, and I thought it'd be very fitting for him to have like a streamer of socks and he's already pulled one off and he's gonna play with it. Oh, it doesn't make any sound. All right, we gotta open some of our gifts that you guys sent us for bamboo. We've got a few other letters in here too, but let's open some mail. Game user hanging out over there. So we'll film the opening right here. Allie made an awesome painting for us. Thanks Allie. Glancy from Idaho sent this. The day Bamboo was born, it says. She made a little book. A little flip book. Yeah. Hey Gage from Utah, thank you for your letter. Uh, breeding pens, we may separate out some of our breeding flock from time to time, but we won't build specific breeding cages for them. Right bud? Oh, look at the card. That's a fun card. Leilani and Peter and Nancy. So they sent us some colorful socks for bamboo and stained glass to hang up. That's awesome, thank you guys. Josephine from Illinois. Painting on this side and a drawing on this side. Thanks Josephine. This is from Alex from California and a nice little drawing. They live for bamboo, the emu. Very fun. This is from Sophie from Nebraska. So Sophie sent us a water watercolored picture of Bamboo when he was a baby with a sock on his head. One of the precious moments we had with Bamboo. Kristen from California sent a package. Let's open it. Oh, that is an amazing picture. A bamboo, peekaboo, and cashew. That is awesome. Look at that. Yeah. Kristen and everyone, thank you so much for all of your artwork and gifts and mail. We had a lot of fun opening it today. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Bamboo. Happy birthday to you. Want to check out that cake? Come on. What did you think when you saw that we got the eggs and when Bamboo hatched? What, what kind of memories do you have? Well, I was a little nervous when Jake was wanting to hatch out these emus because I was picturing these huge, crazy, exotic birds. And I wasn't sure about it, where we were living. It was not that much space. I thought we'd eventually probably sell them to a farm that would have emus and we don't have to care for them when they're older. But I love the idea of hatching them out because I always love hatching projects. And then he hatched out and we had them in our living room, in our house. Yes. And you came up with the idea to put a diaper on them. Yes, when he was making a mess of the house, we definitely had to put a diaper on him. And so we come up with the sock diapers. That was a fun idea. And he got to run around the house for several months. He was such a precious little baby. He would snuggle up with us on the couch while we watched TV. I just love that. That I just Those were such precious moments that I don't think we've ever had with any other animal. Here's your birthday cake. I wonder if it's cut into little pieces of worm. Hey! Okay, what's your favorite memories of Bamboo? I really loved having him in the house. It was so much fun running around with him and filming him with his little pitter-patters on the floor. But I just loved when he would come up to me and would snuggle with me right on my shoulder. I never expected to have an animal that would show some affection towards me and really makes me want to get some other animals or spend more time with animals like bamboo that can reciprocate that affection that we have for them. What's your favorite memories of bamboo? You what do you like the best? The I, I remember running around in the circles inside the house. In the house? Yeah? That was pretty fun. Back and forth in the living room and the kitchen. Yeah, back and forth, back and forth, really fast. Yeah. I gotta protect my ears here. <laughs> well, Bamboo, we love you. 
Hope you had a wonderful first birthday. And Happy that we, birthday. And that we have many more with you. Yes. Happy, Happy birthday, buddy. You want to try and bite? Yes. Here, break off a little piece. Just pick out a little piece. Okay, I'm trying to bite of this cake here. I take it too. Icing's really good. Cake's a little dry, but not bad at all. Yeah. You guys like emu feed? Yes. Emu feed cake? Yes. <laughs> I don't like emu cake. The day emu was born. First day bamboo was just an egg. Then he started to hatch out. There he had a family. Then he got bigger. Then he had some friends. Special day for Bamboo. Happy birthday, Bamboo!